guess we gotta get to the Holy Grove before we're dead. X marks the spot. Center of the dish. Book of life, book of death. You're either in the book of life or the book of death. Jesus is above you. He's the sun. Twirling his light. Towards the center hole. When he gets close enough, I guess that's when you jump into the to the black hole. I think this shit is real. So I think I, th I think it's undeniable. It's fucking funny as fuck. But at the same time, fucking serious as fuck. But yeah, man. We're not a we're not monkeys floating through space on a ball as an accident. The Big Bang, nah, man. I, I don't think so. I don't really believe in modern day science or religion. You know, polarities. All they do is keep you stuck in here like a fucking retard. Um, yeah, man, I think everything's upside down. I think we're upside down right now, which would make sense because everything's fucking in reverse and, uh, some funny ass shit, man. You know, everywhere you go, there's distractions like a motherfucker, man. We're bonded by time and money. Um. Everything, man, you know? People trying to keep you stuck and shit. And, and, you know, everyone's being uh, what they think they should be, you know, based on what's around them. Damn, dude, that shit's crazy. But yeah, the Holy Grail, Holy of Holies. Mother Earth, yeah, gotta worship Mother Earth, and goddesses, worship all though, and exclude none, you know, so, angels or demons, you know, we gotta be cool with them all, uh, yeah man. Earth is flat, you know, float over intent, by far the fucking most out there shit I've ever encountered, but at the same time, uh, I don't know, my heart, my heart, it's in this shit, I guess, you know, you know, I can... I can tell you right now, I'm not 100% sure about a lot of things pertaining to this, but, uh, you know, when you start thinking about, uh, you know, it's not what you believe or think, it's what you're gonna do about shit, you know, it's, 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 it seems like every day it's coming down to, to that, and, uh, what my intentions are is to, uh, bring forth heaven on earth and release everyone from bondage. So, you know, as crazy as these things sound to the outsiders or whatever, you know, it is what it is, you know. And uh, the more you look into it, the more uh, your mind's gonna fuck with you and shit and, you know, uh, make you think otherwise, but I realized you know, all my life I've been using my mind more than my heart, you know. And I mean, I've always used my heart, too. It's always been there, but uh, I think it's time to, uh, you know, switch roles and uh, let your heart take control, you know. Because uh, doubts are doubts, man. You know? And, uh course you're gonna have a lot of doubts I mean we've been lied to by, with so many things in our lives you know 
You know, people lying to us, television lying to us. Uh, you know, all these illusions and shit, yo. And it's hard to fathom, you know, if, uh, if this is all really an illusion or not, but, uh, I mean, goddamn, dude. I don't think this is it, you know? And, uh, you know, if the journey to the Holy Grail is game over, at least in, in this matrix, I don't know. I'd be willing to take that chance, I guess. When what else is there to do here, you know? Seriously. I mean, everything's, everything's limited. And uh, you can say all you want about, uh, you know, being uh, conscious and knowing all this shit and that this is just, it isn't everything. But uh, eventually you're going to die if you stick around here, right? So why not use your imagination and, uh, you know, turn it into reality? It's some funny ass shit, bro. <sighs> At this point, I really ain't afraid to die, man. Because if you're afraid to die, then you're a pussy. You know, because all you're gonna do is worry about dying and shit. And all this shit that uh, you could be using to uh, do other things, right? Like bring forth heaven on earth. You know, even if I don't do it, fuck it, man. What, what, this is, what else do you got to live for, man? After seeing all the shit you've seen in your life. You know? God damn, dude. You know? All these people hungry and shit. Everywhere you walk in public, there's fucking people in wheelchairs and their fucking backs bent and fucking, you know, slower than a baby crawling and shit. Holy fuck, man. You know, when I see that kind of shit, fucks me up, man. Straight up. You know? And, you know, and you see kids and, uh, you know, you... You knew you were, you were like that, and you're like, holy fuck, if, you know, they, they don't know nothing, you know, and it's even worse, they're, you know, there's other things influencing them to keep them farther away from, from knowing something, you know, and uh, that shit breaks my heart, man, you know, but it's all good, though. Everything happens for a reason, I guess. There's no coincidences. I used to think there's coincidences and shit, you know, because so much is going on and shit, you know, but you got to take it, you know, how you get it, really, man, because that's all you're going to have. And, uh, you know, you can't contemplate all your life, you know, could have been this or could have been that and shit like that, you know, because that's just an illusion, too, you know. It's, I mean, we're, we're in, if we're in the Matrix, you know, controlled Matrix, you know, maybe things were better before. I mean, now it's to the point where there's matrixes within matrixes within matrixes, you know what I mean? Like, that's why it's, like, all about deprogramming and shit, you know? And then you know, when you start, you know, giving up a lot of bullshit, you know, that's that's what you're doing. You're deprogramming yourself, you know? And, uh, fuck, man. You start spending more time with yourself and observing instead of, you know, doing shit without thinking about it. Man, start start learning some shit, I guess. You know. Yeah. Blood over intent, man. Get your blood over your intent. I mean if you do that shit, I mean, you're you're making a statement, right? I mean no pussing out now. And uh Fuck, man, it's funny as shit, man. Yeah. But yeah. Let this flat. Holy grail. If you die here, you might very well be coming back. Soul harvest.
for someone else's energy, which is what we're doing when we're working our jobs and paying our bills or giving our energy to something, you know. You think you're giving it to the government or you're giving it to to give back to the people and shit, but I mean, there's all these crooks out there, man. You know, they're taking and siphoning your shit, you know. Damn, man. It's sad, man, but it is what it is. Hopefully we can get this shit done 2019 because hindsight's 2020. Just kidding, but yeah, y'all know what I mean.